Welcome to episode of Tiger Woods PT 2004, the core showcase. We're looking to put Spyglass Hill behind us. It was a poor performance. All on the side, a poor performance. Welcome, Poppy Hills. Goes better for us. Let's go. Hello, everyone. This is Gary McCord for EA Sports. David Faraday is To be fair, we have one good face, that's true. But otherwise, Spagger still wasn't great. Oh, God, I don't mind the undulation here. That took, uh, it's downhill as well. You know, I said that. I said that. I said I played a good one. We'll try it again here. We'll try it again here. Try and curve it with the dog leg. Let's work it out again because I think we need the extra distance. Yeah, let's work it out. I think that's long. Late shut film. Late cinematic camera. It wasn't long at all. It's actually just on the money. But that'll make sure it's an uphill port. That's just a wonderful shot. Which is what I prefer. Which we shall take, right? Should be an easy birdie to start the day up. There you go. Simply bird it. Right, par three. Come on. We have plenty of holding ones here. That's right, that's right. Five par threes as well, apparently. I think he was going to say that. This one is hunting for the flag. Ah, not quite. Still a pretty good shot around the hole. Can't complain. And we get the easy bird it. Okay. Hill is a dog leg to the left, dog leg left but I think shot of at least 215 yards I think the approach shot is uphill you can clear the trees here if I'm honest we'll try my greedy I'm trying my greedy here I need all the powers in the world though that'll do it I'm trying to get into pitching range is what I'm trying to do here just trying to kill this ball, Gary. And it's worked out brilliantly. Which is 63 yard drive. We are in pitch range, but if anything, we're too close. Because if I pitch this with a certain, it's going to play on the hill. Control flop wedge, it is then. Flop, flop shot, it is then. No, oh, there you go. That'll do. We'll get it here, but we'll make sure we've got an easy putt. Got caught between two clubs on the pitch shot. I didn't trust controlling a pitch and red shot. Because if you under hit it too much, you're screwed. If it over hit it, you're screwed. So we'll take the same approach for now. This run hasn't gone wrong yet, so there's no need to take too many risks. <laughs> Basically. That'll do. I'm hoping for a mid iron shot to get enough loft. What kind of distance are we talking about here, David? Looks to be about 200 yards. Eh, uh, we'll go far iron. Should be safely on the green. Stay by the hole, that's a good shot. Whatever it was, great shot. Three feet to the pin. This has to be a deal, surely. There it is. We are too close for the cinematic camera. I was ruined for a second that I was quite worried. Not the easiest put in the world to say we're that close. The fifth is a straight golf hole which provides the first okay. water on the golf course. The There's a lake to the right side. Lie, causing the ball to slide from left to right, thus bringing the lake okay. very much into play. With your accuracy, you should be able to hit the flag stick from here. I mean, that's pushing it, mate. It's a bit far for that. Got to make sure we don't end up in the uh, in the lake. I'm hoping that's a sandwich pitch. It is, it is, but oh, 
There's so much pitch and much gap sucks. We got max stars. I go oh! I thought that was it. The game troll me again. Well, so far so good. The sixth hole is an innocent looking par three, but okay. The wind's pretty strong here. I don't like that. But if you end up. Downhill, seven iron is going to go too far, but if it end up down like on this bit, you're going to be screwed, in, aren't you? Uh, I think a power boost at eight times is going to do the trick. Is that too much power boost? No, it's straight in, into, into the cinematic camera. Oh, it's gone left on the bounce. It was the right call. My gut instinct was correct. I've got the power spot on, but it's gone. Run on the bounce. Oh well. He's a bird. He's a bird. Can't complain. The seventh of Poppy Hills is an uphill sweeping dog leg left. Okay, dog leg left, but I think we've got enough power to kind of just uh hit this normally. No power boost, it's uphill against the wind that'll play short. It'll end up just fine. Yeah, that'll do. Hopefully a lob wedge shot here. No, I think a pitch. Uh, yeah, I think a, a pitch shot here. I'm honest. This should be below the hole, right on the front of the green. Yeah, if I did a little short, I wasn't sure where to spin that, but still. About the hole. Five minutes will be about there. Yeah, about there. Yep, on the money. Birdie. All right, two holes for the front nine to go. The first of four sharp dog. Another dog leg here. Oh how? It's a shot. Oh, it's a shot. The wind's gonna help it out. I'm gonna gamble the wind does the job for me here. Alright, this tee shot's gonna catch the rough. Oh, it's gone too far. Yeah, I tried to avoid having to play the fade, but I think we're close enough, it doesn't really matter. Then again, I should, play this. I should just play the two line in the end. Oh, is it the flag? Another, the weirdest roll. I mean, that's a really good show from that. Control the loft wedge, log wedge, whatever. Out of the rough and it hits the flag. I thought it was just going to play just long I could roll it back into the hole, but obviously hitting the flag screwed it over. The inward hole in the front nine of Poppy Hills is reachable for the longer. Okay, well, obviously it's a path five. We want to reach this in two. The inward hole in the front. Uh, it seems like an iconic call. I should play this as a thumbnail. The longer hitters with a drive aimed between the two fairway bunkers. As designed, the drive should be played up to the yeah, right. You've got a massive rough patch between the green and the, uh, the, the fairway. On the golf course. We'll see what we can do here. I'll have to do. Struggling with the power boost. I'm getting old. <laughs> I'm getting old. That's a big league swing right there. I don't think we a 41 yard drive. I see a tough shot. Downhill. A little more than 200 yards to the hole. Against the wind, I think. It's going to roll left, so I'm going to aim for the hole. The wind will blow it to the right. Then it'll, get blow it'll roll back to the left. That's the idea. That's the idea. That's not bad, actually. We'll take that. We'll take that. A little further away than I'd like, it's going to be a pretty sharp putt, isn't it? Oh no, 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 that's not bad. Yeah, easy. Okay, no, that was a good hole. Only just that, but I'll take it. Okay. We have three par threes on the back nine, and obviously we want the hole in one. 
But so far, so good. Much better than Spyglass Hill. We were quite consistent, only one bad shot, but, but we recovered quite nicely by hitting the flag. This is an iconic ball. I believe this is one on the uh, Tiger Woods challenge on his Dream 18. But I think it's the first hole. I think. Yeah, there you go. What's the main objective here? Get the eagle and avoid the lake. So we need all the power boosts in the world, really. He's trying to take those trees out of, out of the equation with max uh, power. And that's exactly what we've done. That's a massive roll. Nearly 400 yards. Yeah, control sandwich will do this. That looks okay. Depends how short it plays. Ah, that's controlled. No debate on job selection. That was exactly Maybe I should have gone full sandwich, but I think we're okay. That's not great. That's not a great putt. Okay, right. We'll get the power back, because the power is easy. About there. About there. Well, the scientific camera's in play. It just loops around. <laughs> it thought about staying out. We get a lucky break. We'll take it. On this uh, optimal run. It's still on. We're getting the scores we've won. Not had a blind over hole yet. Downhill against the wind, though. Okay. We'll try this. I think it's going to bounce left. Coming down in the lawn, I believe. It did, but it bounced on the hill, so it cut the power. But still, it's a makeable putt. For eleven birdies in a row. There we go. We're quite close, it wasn't particularly sensitive, which makes aiming harder, if I'm honest. When you're that close. Right. How long's this hold? It's a par 5, so... Oh, oh shite. I mean, to get there in 2, we have to play this, don't we? Let's be honest. Well, I tried to play the draw, but it didn't actually recognise it. Which sucks. It recognised my input, but still. Down the hill, I think we can save this. Yeah, I've got three items downhill. Then playing it short and trying to roll it's the safest play. Oh, I didn't roll this. Oh, I thought it was going to really kick off that, but we're on the green. First bad hole of the day here, but we can still save it. It's a makeable putt. Cinematic camera, we save the hole. Yeah, pretty much on the money. We save the hole. The thirteenth is an uphill swinging dog leg to the right. Right, it's uphill. We can't get there in two. I'm actually gonna play three wood just so it's a uh, easy approach. So it's low bridge, low bridge range for sure. Watch out on the right. That's where this one's headed. That's right, fine. I'll kick into the fairway. David Ferdy, what do you say? I'll sandwich you. I think we got about yards Basically, I need to play an, an easy full shot. Right on target. Should have played a full shot there. Another tough putt. There we go. Okay, we're playing much better here. Couple of tough putts lately, but we've made them. The fourteenth is a sharp dog leg left, which requires a tee shot of two. How 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 long's the the hole? Okay, I think a two iron there is actually going to do it. I think we're fine. 
I, I, I hope that's enough power boost. Oh, we're fine. We'll play it safe. Yeah, we're well in range, it's fine. Control pitch and wedge. See how close this gets. I've gone for the hole, it's going to just miss it. A really good shot, though. We'll tap it in, the puss is out of my hands, it can't go wrong. Tap and bird it. Two holes that are par threes. Split with the par four and a par five. This long par three plays slightly downhill to Okay, long par three. Downhill against some wind though. This one will end up on the putting surface. At the hole I would have went for that. And a bit too aggressive really, it's Can tough putting. It? This would be I went for the hole in one. Straight birdies. There we go, on the money. Nice, controlled, simple enough putt. Still got more hole in one chance. We had a few sessions in a row now with hole in one. I must have more course showcase episodes for this one. When I get a hole in one than when I don't. I think there's more episodes where I do at least get one. Than ones where I don't get any. I think it's uh, uphill, this will play short. Fine. Shit! Shit! And shit! Is that tree in the way? Crap, I'm gonna have to, have to aim over here. Oh yeah, I've completely messed this hold up. Fucking trees! Oh! A pause not a guarantee here, if I'm honest. That was actually a good shot. We'll save par, that is a nightmare. Well, this score is beatable now for sure. We need a hole in one or a double eagle to save it. Stupid trees. Downhill, but against the wind, I think it's sick. I'm playing aggressive here. I'm going for the hole in one. I'm going for the hole in one, it's hit the flag and it stayed out! It was too close! I've hit the flag twice today! Oh, I've hit the flag twice! Oh. Okay, we're heading for home. I've been robbed here today. Not bad, but it could be even better. <sighs> oh well. Yeah, gotta love that one. That's enormous. There we are. I think we can get yeah, I think we cleared the tree just about. You could probably wear a blindfold and still make this. I'm not trying to get a double eagle. That are many of them, Mr. Dapper. I've gone for it. Game. Okay. I've been what pull it off. Playing for eagle now, David. It breaks right at the end. Well, I went for it. The last two holes, I absolutely went for it. Well, only one off, kind of. The, I did it only hit mid ten fairways. Only missed, only missed like one, I think. I don't know. Anyway, regardless, it's a decent round. That par is a stinker. But otherwise, could have been that much better. But I did get robbed there. I hit the flag twice. Just missed a double eagle as well. Played quite well, I just that one mistake. Uh, I, I would have been in deep, or so I couldn't get there anyway. Because I played too high, and I'm not getting past the tree. Well, it is what it is. Next time, we're getting towards the back end. It really. I saw the Emerald Dragon's not far away. Oh no, never mind. And it's Royal Birkdale, and it's I think these are the last two real courses. The rest will be the fantasy ones. More fantasy. Oh, GM18. There you go, I can play that as well. But for now, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time.